Peace, many depart for the European shamanism and modern pagan lifestyle channel. What is a druid? A druid is a philosopher, a politician, a judge, a translator, an advisor. What does this tell us? It tells us that people make mistakes. And sometimes we need somebody else to guide us. Sometimes we need somebody to organize our own thoughts for us. Sometimes we need somebody just to be occupied with a particular type of knowledge and then advise us. Even the king needs advice. Nothing lasts and everything flows as the Greeks would say, Heracletos. It means that even when certain things might have been correct at a particular moment, things might have changed already. And so we need an objective thinker or somebody who is objective to look at the facts and guide our decision making. Not everybody can do this because if you're farming, you're occupied with farming for most of the day. So a philosopher will do this work for you. The modern druid will need to think and then act about how we can order and organize our lives as modern pagans. Because we all know that the system needs to change. But in order for that change to happen, we need to know first of all what is going on, what is wrong, how to repair it and where to go to towards the future. A druid will have to have the knowledge of the Bard and the Ovid along with the modern scientific knowledge, um, uh, the knowledge of philosophy and so forth. So a druid is not just doing the spiritual things or whatever because we have the Bards and the Ovids for that. It also has to deal with philosophy um, even with political actions. And this is where the Druid comes in. He's, if you will, the leader of the modern pagans because he has occupied, occupied himself with gathering all of that knowledge. And now, in contrast to a capitalistic society, he will have to spread that knowledge into that society in order for that society to change. This is a difficult task. And so, as druids, um, and druids here is just an example of the Celtic piece of um, philosophy or, or, uh, uh, or the, pol the politician or whatever, um, but there can be positions um, just like that in a modern Germanic paganism or Slavic paganism or whatever. But um, the Druids will need to gather up, will need to organize themselves um, to have this political discussion, this philosophical discussion, in order to truly shape the future away from this capitalistic system. So, um, I've written this down before and I'll say it now uh, again. We need a pan-pagan council, an international pan-pagan council that um, is a forum for a dialogue between the European uh, shamans or, or druids or whatever and the, um, the leaders and the shamans of, of the natives all over the world because we can only change the system if we work together. We have a critical mass here. I'm not sure how to do this yet, but if you know, <laughs> um, or if you want to be in contact or whatever, you know, hit me up. Um, we, need to, we need to really uh, organize our thinking here and organize ourselves and, and group up uh, in order so that we can influence not only paganism, but the entire world all around us. So best of luck to you.